Today I am just outside Tindrum and I've come to one of my favourite places in Scotland. I've never really taken a what I would classify as a fantastic photograph here but fingers crossed today might change that. What we have behind us just here is a forest. I can't pronounce it. I'll put the name up there. We've got really changeable light. We've got some sun going on over there. Some crazy big dark clouds going on over there. Today is a little bit different from what I usually do. What I'm planning to do today is specifically go to try and take a photograph. And what I really want to concentrate on today is composition. Gonna go into the forest, gonna find a couple of interesting things, maybe see if I can get a photograph and see how it goes. Okay, my interest has been pricked. I think that's the right phrase. Anyway, look. Just up at the end of this little opening here, we've got a tree. There's quite a nice silhouette of that tree against the bright mountain. And every so often, the skies are opening up. This is the kind of thing that you really need to work with. Okay, I've just arrived. I've seen something cool and it's very tempting to set the camera up, take a few snaps and then move on. What you really should be doing is spending a little bit of time if you can and really getting the most out of the image. There's nothing worse than getting home and saying to yourself, oh, I wish I'd moved a little bit to the left or if I'd moved five meters closer, that would have looked far better. So these are the types of things that I'm trying to think about whenever I'm out taking photographs. This is one of the things that I'm talking about. I've spotted a tree, which I really like. The tree is the subject, and I've spent about 20 minutes moving the camera back and forward just a little bit to see if I can get um, the composition that I want. Quite happy with this. There's quite a lot of contrast because it's a cloudy day. I am looking for things that pop. Um, we've got the tree. We've got like a bright background from the grass. We've got lovely green foliage on the tree. Um, yeah, this has taken a wee bit of work. I think I like it, but maybe tomorrow when I have a look at it on the computer, I will have changed my mind. Been dandering about here for about maybe an hour taking pictures of trees. And whilst it is fantastic to take loads of pictures of trees, I am starting to tire a little. There's quite a nice river there down, down to my left there. And as the light starts to die, I'll maybe be able to start to open up my shutter speed a little bit, which might create some nice long exposures of water. And doesn't everyone just love a long exposure of some water? And there's loads of stuff to photograph in here. On my way to the river, I have come across another little opening with some beautiful trees in the far side. The colors here, great. We've got greens, we've got light browns, dark browns. Uh, this is nice. I'll show you it in the back of the camera as well, just so that you can see what I'm seeing here today. I'm going to make my way down to another river and see if I can take any pictures. I didn't really get anything there. There were a couple of nice wee streams, but everything just felt too busy. Um, I'll put a couple of pictures up, I suppose, of what I got. I think that's probably me for today. <clears throat> Stop for a wee bit of food here and the light's really starting to fade and there's nothing really happening sunset wise so I think I might just call it quits, eat a wee bit more food and then take a dander back to the car. <laughs> 